movers welcome to this week video before i go into this week topic that i want to talk about let me give you guys some updating news remember in my last video i showed you guys how my suit got damaged well good news the airline is replacing my suitcase they had given me an option of they gave me the money for my suitcase or they gave me a voucher that i have to use within 12 months so i am happening and mind you, the difference between the cost of the suitcase and the voucher, they were just giving me $60 more. Now, I can't sign up for that. I'm getting my check for my suit. Secondly, also in that video, I spoke about moving my money, middle of the night, tired, making great financial decisions when I should not be doing it. I'm moving my money from my interest earning savings account and had it hanging out in Wise. I think Wise heard me. Or the Holy Spirit said, you know, I need to cheer my child up. About two days after I recorded or posted that video, I got an email from Wise telling me, oh, if I would like to have money in my savings account, I have an option of signing up where they will give me 3.71%, which on my account, which you will put in at the beginning of each month. So I took it from a 3.5, griping and complaining about that move. And God said, let me cheer my baby up. So it in 3.7. That is great, fantastic news. I've been bearing all of these not so good news, cloudy news to you guys. So when it's time to celebrate, when it's good news, I need to share it also. So let's talk about this week's video. Hi, this is Paula Simon, and this is my bold journey. Well, guys, I decide this week to take a different approach to my video. And it dawned on me sometime during the week, is that over the years that I travel, people will ask this question, is the place safe? Do you know anyone there? You're so brave to go those places. And over the years, I took the statements as I heard it. Is the place safe? Do you know anyone there? You're brave to go. But I start thinking about this thing. And I honestly believe it's that not everyone who asks you that, really and truly believe that the place that you're going to is so unsafe because look at how news is if there's any problem any part of the world you will hear it on the six the eight the nine the ten every hour news it will be breaking Something that is happening like youtube they have so many videos out there they got tiktok they got instagram real someone will be talking about the dangers there okay you don't know anyone in the place but do you know someone everywhere you go no you go to a new workplace or wherever the case might be but i i believe is that persons it's somewhere even if it's consciously or subconsciously wondering if i go to this place would it be familiar would i be comfortable there no one wants to get on a plane and go somewhere or invest any money driving wherever it is and you're not comfortable i decided to say how could i communicate to someone or to my friends or family who would ask this question but i honestly believe is that they're looking for answers that will say if you travel somewhere you will feel comfortable so i decided this week with last friday i got up and i said this is my day for roaming guys i have to put a day for roaming on my calendar because i will get back into old polar mood and do not move and i said you know what I'm going to take out the cell phone and record the neighborhood as I walk. Let persons see that there's stores selling hats and bags and sunglasses. There's some other store you could get all your phone accessories. And if you want a new phone and phone plan, there's a grocery store, plates. You have fruit stand. Let persons realize that by travel, I go into a place and I look for something that I could relate to. And most of the time, it's for so the food. When you look at the food, be it you're in Turkey, you're in Georgia, in Ecuador, London, wherever I have traveled, New Zealand, you find that there's food that you're familiar with. There's the eggplant, there's the cabbage. But you got the shallot, you got the onion, you got garlic, you got tomatoes. You will see beans and peas, there's rice, there's pasta. You see things that is familiar or similar you will see cars. You recognize the car, a brand of the car. I haven't seen it here so far, 
But in other countries, you see a Zara or a H&M. You would see a fast food place. So if you're a McDonald's or you're a Burger King fan, chances are you come out, you will see it. So that's what I did. This week video would be the recording of I just walking around the neighborhood. And you see it. There's buses, there's cars, there's people walking around. You see them not dressing weird. You see them very much in fashion, right? You've seen a lot of people with a face in the phone, which is a common sight. And you see places that you could buy things. I hope it will help anyone who looked at it and have this all apprehension. When we travel, we don't be stepping into no mystical place. It's not, not looking like if it's, it's a space age or you see fairies or multicolored things and people floating around. No, it's people getting on the buses. You see these workplaces. You see familiar signs, car dealership, where it is. So when you travel, there is the difference of things like lunch, which I'm good at signing, asking people the time. The man asks if a knife to do this. He understand. I learn whether it's thank you or, or, or goodbye or yes or no, or whatever the case might be. But you could go into these countries and you're able to visit or to enjoy yourself. It is not that way out there that you can't experience. And you learn a lot from traveling. Movers, I'm telling you this. When you travel, it puts you in a case where you should be more alert. You're not in your regular comfort zone. You're not, oh, I know this here. No. And that is even good for our brains. It's good for us as individuals. It makes us learn something. You get more alert, right? Home, you little. When you travel, you're more alert. So that is what I will be showing you. So that is this week's video. And I'm looking forward to you seeing something and learning something. I realize that, you know, Paul isn't in such a far off weird place. No, there might be a difference of time. There might be there is a difference of time, a six hours difference. I have to spend a couple hours on the plane and who knows, make two or three stops. But yet still, the people here, they're taking the children to school. The stopping in the evening at the grocery, at the food stand, at the bakery, at the butcher stand to buy the meal because they have to cook. So you see people living their life. You see them dressed there at going to work. You see some people hanging out. You see the school children after school finding some particular spot or some coffee shop to hang out in, just like what the kids will do since we were small. We'll do right now in America. They're doing it here. So although there's so much a difference, we're so much alike. Our day-to-day -day life is so much alike. So guys, enjoy those videos. If you are new to this channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber or visitor, welcome also. Don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on the notification button so YouTube will let you know when a new video up uploaded. Also, please share. It will be greatly appreciated. I know someone, and I hope a whole lot of people, will be able to learn from my experience as I stop thinking about living boldly and actually living the bold life. So guys, take care and have a blessed day. Walking through my neighborhood and this time recording of the place, see where it's going to lead me to school. Okay. I've seen it. Little Chubbs baby. What you see a lot. Men just hanging around. Okay. First real walk. Oh, there's a lounge and a bar here. Where you see pretty often. At a big market. See? This is one of several food stands you will see all over. So, you don't really need to stockpile the fruits or vegetables because you could get it. And look at the sidewalk. You have to be very careful. This is where you could get your ankle in a tangle. And there's the bus over there. I'm just going to take a walk because 
far as I feel like walking and then I'll turn back. I have to get some groceries though. Like fruits. And I'll pick up a few vegetables. I love the eggplant. So I'm going to get me some eggplant. I've been eating a whole lot of it. Oh, this, is a, this is a new building. See, got the security there and a the flag. Or be some important building. So that's it. Oh, you see the well grooming? I did the pictures. Oh, finally, see somewhere selling suitcases. Okay. Oh, Lord. Hello. Ah, these suitcases look like they had three lives before. I'm interested. This is the kind of oven I have in the apartment, the middle one. The thing is like an air fryer. So you know what, Paula? Looking at the thing and being judgmental, thinking it might not be hot enough, and put my sweet potato and my beets inside. The beets was two turn like, like one, or a quarter of one. I fell asleep and woke up a burning throat and nose and it was the thing overcooking you see all these nuts here this here is it's natural state a lot of walnuts and so this where you see a lot here you see a lot of places selling these like kind of clothing I will wait for him cocoa pet shop you see? Look, there's a cat there. There's a penny. Again, this is another food place that you could come and get vegetables and you could get fruits too. But this one is my only fruits. Okay. This is a bakery. You can see all these things, these fresh bread in there. See? And they have all these different kind of pastries and puddings. Hello. See? All these different kind of pastries and puddings. Oh goodness, you could go crazy. Yeah. Selling all this stuff. Look at all these little, little land over place. And then there's a bar somewhere where you can get drinks. Just now watching at me. It's got this pomegranate. You know, I haven't tried pomegranate since I've been here. Perhaps I should. And then when you go up there, they will have like nuts. Let me see if you have pistachio. You see, this is where you buy all the nuts. You see, they got this pistachio and all the other nuts. I think this is some form of drink, which I don't know what it is. And this, this is honey. I know that. You see, walnuts. <laughs> I'll perhaps get it on my way back. And all kind of nuts. With all these kind of nuts, I don't want no peanuts. Oh, you see this big bunch of spinach? And this is shallot. You don't find a very fine one. You just get these big coarse ones. And look at the strawberries. Oh, look at these <laughs> tomatoes in this vine. I never seen them like that. And the pears. Everything they weigh here. So even if you buy a pear, they're gonna put it on the scale and you're gonna pay for it based on its weight. The weight. Here in America we will you'll buy one pear for certain like 150 or whatever it is. No. Everything is on a scale, you put it on a scale. But place is nice guys. You get a chance to visit, you see. All over you will find little 
holidays like this here. And they got their houses and it'll eat another set of business to the back there. You go at the back there and you surprise the amount of stuff we're going on. And as usual, someone sitting on having coffee. And although it's in case they still consider it outdoors. So chances are you will get some smoke in your face. I know it might be weird. And I'm the only one walking around with masks on my face, but you know what? They're accustomed to smoking, so you walking by there with the smoke will get hit you in your face. Nobody turns the head when they see you coming. Because there's a culture. Me with smoke problem is visiting. So see they have a lot of places like that. Look the bird. Be a car dealership place. You see more cars than buses. You see more cars than taxis. You hardly see taxi around. You know? You hardly see taxi around. You see them most far. I don't think the locals really use them because they're very expensive. In comparison, yeah, in some cases, they might be very well tipping towards. New York cars. Yeah. From the airport, the taxi is $25, $35. You see a lot of chairs like these in Turkey. These are the outside chairs. Yeah. And as usual, men look. Yeah, the taxi will be $25, 35 euros. So, so we head into like 40 US dollars and then you get the bus and the bus is three dollars yep the bus is three three US you see these doors these doors are beautiful still celebrating Valentine yeah the bus is three Ooh, look a funeral home at least the words is the same thing funeral I don't know if you guys could see it in the yeah, the bus is three dollars, and the taxi drivers have the balls to tell you more thirty-five dollars. I wonder why. I get on the bus, I pay my three dollars, and then I pay five for the taxi swirl me around when I came in. That would have happened even if I had taken the other taxi from the airport at the same. Budupa would have been in the same circle in a wrong. So I spent eight, eight US dollars instead of nearly 40 US dollars. I like these chairs, I never see any like these. You see, this is nice. Oh, look, this lady here, beautiful. <laughs> Looks like George Constanzo, mother from, from Whitney. Oh gosh, Jerry Seinfeld and show. How come I forget the name of the show now? I'm slipping. Anyway, I think I'm going to get my tattoo, which I had planned to get since I was age 40. It's 19 plus years ago. Oh, these are air fryers. Oh, you know what? I should go in here and see. I'm looking for a knife. Imagine I had a house with knives never used and i give away and everything else now i'm here oh look at this fancy air fryer oh my gosh this is nice i see that in oh look this is a water faucet telling you the the temperature of your water it's nice you don't see these things i'm just seeing let me see if they have any knives. This Hello. Is... Hello. Let me see. Madame. No, they look like they sell more pots. Madame. Hi. One moment. One moment. Okay, yeah. I'm looking for a knife. Oh, all right. <laughs> you see, this is interesting. Look at this. So you could uh, look at you guys have knives? Like kitchen knives? Photo product, telephone, photo telephone. Product. Okay. Like you will cut. Let me. Six, six, yeah. Six, six, six. All right. 
Look at these things in here. This is the store electronic. Mm. I should have got to learn the word for knife. I didn't think about Oh, yeah. Oh, he have to pull these. Uh, uh, okay. You have, yeah. I'm looking for, you see these like small peering knives. I'm looking for like a big one to cut. In the apartment, I have like these here. And these here are so hard to cut with. You see, they have some unique looking stuff here. Look at these little pots. I know if my sister Deborah was here, she would have gone crazy because she loves these stuff. <laughs> Deborah, hope you don't see this video. You hear me saying this about you. Yeah. Uh -huh. No, I won't be glad. Yeah, yeah. Look at bottom of these. Oh, yeah. Set. Oh, it's only as set. a set. Okay. Set. Not, 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 not single, no, not one. No, whoa, no. So, set, 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 how set, set, set. was the cost? Oh, 40, oh, 40, 50. Occasion, occasion, okay. occasion. But they're nice. Do that a pass. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. they are. They yeah, are. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. Look the bottom of the iron. This, yes, I got a calculate. How much is 48? It's like nearly 35. I gotta calculate and let you guys know how much it is like 35 US dollars or 40. It's 48 50. Let me see 90 48 50. Okay, it's too much money I want to spend for knives. I just want one that I could keep in my check-in bag. Yeah, that I could keep in my checking bag because you go to these different Airbnb places and the most don't have they don't have not like good nice cooking with if you do get one and here you won't find the most like the nice you show me first those small like the nice if you're looking for a knife to eat with the cutteries no they give you the the one that will pluck your tongue out your mouth so guys I'm just walking I have to remember where I am <laughs> well, I have to post another video being lost but these are beds and furniture I'm gonna walk till I don't feel like walking anymore okay I'm gonna skip across the road but I want you guys to see the this is at the junction I don't know wherever I am you see the thing about it you see this red light and it's it's red and it's counting down really true they can't figure out if you could cross or not so providing it's red I stay and put on the side of the road I look you see now you have the green over on the other side well this is when I can move sometimes there's red and you will see Albanians or people who live here or who comfortable walking they will be walking across when it's red not this rascal and since I have nothing to do a whole day to do it I can wait till it turn green and then I will walk across anyway you guys getting a very long semi rambling video okay you see it's green for the tree now but this is the time I could walk head into the gas station something that I don't miss by not having a car yeah I'll see how far I could walk and then I'll come back I guess this is a cafe the weather is so nice but you know who's very bottom up me this is a material building one that I would never want to live in you see 
all the way up there. Oh, it's a straight, straight junction. She's cleaning. Okay, Qatar Center, Tirana. This is a major junction that you could turn right and head to another part of being here. And then I guess you go straight, you'll continue being here. I think, oh, this is the ring center. Oh, I am taking extremely longer than usual to figure stuff out. I think it's because when I came the first week, I had all the movement of the place, dealing with the airline and everything. But I was here. Yes. Myself and Karen. In fact, Karen brought me down here. Well, let me behave like as I figure it out. She does. And this is a usual scene. We approach in there. Oh, those side they look so nice. You dare not sit. If somebody is going to start smoking. You see these little children here? They've got the dogs having them begging. This is what they be doing. Okay, you see, you could cross here. There isn't a traffic light, but what's supposed to happen is that if you're in the walkway, they're supposed to wait. I guess they're in the walkway and I still wait to see, make sure they're waiting for me to cross. I did not realize I was here before I'm still trying to see I think this place is the place that sells household stuff let me see if I find a knife it's like a clearance place yeah it looks like second hand stuff could get clothing and so this kind of thing. Let me see. Let me see. But they only have like things to the house. You could get like curtains and towels and so here. I don't think you could get knives. Ah but natural air so beautiful the day is so good that they don't have to put on the air conditioner or anything you could just leave it open this is beautiful especially for the this is nice See the, I think this is a place where people donate stuff you know we have them and then they resell it and you find sometimes things with the tags on it. At least this is what I, I heard. Don't let me behave like if I'm a pro. And I don't even know how to ask for a knives or so. This is the towel you that was in front of the first inside the first AMB. I told you guys it's a flimsy towel. You see how thin it is. And when he tried to tell me that. The mat was there all along. You see, I don't need these things. If I was setting up a home, well then, because definitely it would be coming here to set up the house. But I need a knife. I'm going to walk and see if I find another store that would have it. You see, it's mostly clothing. It's like the dresser less in Atlanta. This is like dress the best. I'm going down the stairs. Thanks. If you're passing through, you got kids there. Let me see what here. All oh, these like intimate stuff. And these are shoes. This is like dress the best. Yeah. Let's see. 
I think when you have certain things with an extra tag on it, the mean it's at for the discount. You see, this is a, this one. This place is selling bags. Let me see, because I need a suitcase, guys. I really need one. Ah, this is like the one that I have, but it's a different brand, a similar name. And I think I'm going to move away from the hard shells because for this year I had two hard shells that broke. So I really and truly looking for a soft bag. But this one, I don't know if it's new or not. It doesn't look so. And it was the cost. Guess what? I'm, perhaps in the next two to three weeks I will need one. If you decide to go on a bus or a plane, I would need. Like this here again this is hard shell all of these is hard shell yeah what's how um, yeah look look right 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 it here <laughs> no not this grand uh -huh. lake albania mm -hmm. first, yeah kilogram uh -huh. okay. or oh, 20 yeah okay. kilogram kilogram thank you all right. Who's here? Mm-hmm. Here, here, here. No, I don't want one. This here. Is, this, yeah. The counter, Yeah. Yeah. Nizete yeah. tre kilogram. Twenty three kilogram. Twenty three. Yeah. Kilogram. Nizete tre. Aha. Slimi es kio. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. No, this is your pen. This is yours. This is your own. <laughs> yes. yep. Yeah. I'll, I'll come back. Okay. Uh, see the lady. So 23. I have to calculate the one, too. I'm still on this quest to find my mm -hmm. knife. Not 23. She said 25. Still on my quest to find my knife. This is another place. You see a little coffee place. I have a barber shop there. I was down here. Prep and juice. Ah, see everybody have the little cup of coffee. This is very important. The drink that whole day. Pastry place. See outside. This is a school over there. There's a school over there. I'll see if I find the name of this street and I'll show it to you guys. I would not even attempt to, to call it. That pastry, the place in there looks like they have some nice pastries, but you see all the stores over that side. So you see where I came out from? Oh. All those birds. You see, where I came from, you just turn and suddenly you're on a main, a main street. This square is so nice. I sat in it about I think about like two or three days after I was in the country. See again. We just have a turn, a road, and you just get in the walk, please. And as I said, they're supposed to stop. See the square? When I came the day, they didn't have so many people in it because the day it was very cold. But today is nice. It's really beautiful. So, a lot of people are. Berlin travel. 
you see now, see you have travel agencies here. Here is so nice. Here is so nice. It's so nice. I hope I can come back. There's a vacancy. And you see the open door cafes. You could sit and get something to eat. I don't think you could go and sit there without buying something. I don't think you could do that. Well, who knows? They might be able to. Pasta and pizza. Oh, this is a good Friday walk. I think. Oh, this is the Artelia Air airline that messed up my bag and had a crappy plane. All you guys who getting ready, getting married, you see, you could come over here and get your wedding dress. You could get it in Turkey too. At least I don't know now if you're interested in the wedding dresses, but they had like a whole street that is dedicated to wedding. Wedding dress stores that selling wedding dresses. I have the recording somewhere or the other. This is a lot. You see around. A little snack bar. What? Oh, I have to find somewhere to sit. It's like I'm not going to find my knife. I have to find some other day for it. But at least you guys get a chance to see Albania from the comfort of your sofa. You did not have to deal with a crappy plane. I hope you would like the video and say thank you for the Come spare me. You spare me from having to deal with a crappy plane and bad seat. Ah, uh, this old lady. This lady, she's rocking it. Love she outfit. Okay, don't let me say old lady because apparently this is a problem. Everybody is forever young. Yeah, dare not say the old. All right. So, have to make a stop soon. See outlet she enclosed. Thank you. He waited for me to cross. That's nice. Ah. This is the one. Hello. Hello. Oh, hello. Fine. This is the one that is similar to to the Starbucks. It's interesting, mostly when you see your travel and you see people of the coffee color, they really try to make any eye contact with you. They turn their head to one side and they pretend that you're not there. These are very nice. Yeah, and I think that I was taken aback by the greetings that I didn't even know how to respond. It's just a custom seat when you travel anyway we're not getting into that all right guys i will have to turn back just now because i'm not seeing the opportunity to buy a knife and i think i'm starting to get hungry but as i look further down on the other side if you look between the bus and the thing i'm seeing a set of look like businesses it might be restaurants I might be able to go in and point at something and get food to eat. I think that might be it. 
I'll go and point and then they point something else too and we exchange some moon eyes and I get something it's been working and that form of communication has worked all over the world who knows I might get charge at 30 cents more or 50 cents more I know for certain it's not a hundred dollars or not even a ten dollars more so I thought to cool with that I'm sorry to fool with that. Okay, I'm just giving you guys a heads up. I have no intention of editing these videos. All the parts that might be boring, that always have a little thing that I think could speed up the camera. Whatever it is, this road is blocked from traffic. Ah, this looks nice. So you see you have these big blocks here. And these cars double park. And who knows? For the day out might be triple park. You see how do you see this here? It's leading to some other neighborhood way behind there. Ah, this is like a Dollar Tree. This Euro. I wonder if I find a knife in here. Let me see. Let me see if they have nice. Hello. Yeah, this is like a dollar tree. Let's see, it got some common stuff inside. Let's see if they have some familiar items. Like the candy in the candy region. I can find all these things. Yeah. Something like baby food. Let me see if I could find a knife. If not one to cut meat, at least one to eat with. I'm having a problem with that steak knife, the small steak knife. Eating my spinach and sweet potato is a major challenge. It's a clothespin. This is an art supply area. Keeping candles. It got the whole vibe of Dollar Tree. Yeah. I don't know if everything is a is a dollar. I have a lot of these plates and some. I think it's like one fifth to nine one fifth to nine Albania uh, money, which might be less like a dollar for us. But I didn't use my credit card, it's only then I know for certain the exchange you see here. Yeah, you come here and you want to start your little place. You just come in here and get all these little, little things. At least you could get, you see, wood spoons and things like that. Paper straws. You see, this is it. I don't know, this is for, oh, appetizers. Okay. You could serve appetizers inside of a, oh, make a party look very fancy. You see, see, I like this. Oh, this is plastic. If it's not glass, I should look to see if I find. I'm not seeing anything like a pirate's dish or so. And I had, oh, this is a strainer. I had one that I was thinking about bringing, you know, but I didn't. I was so obsessing over weight. And now I wish I had it because they have something to put in the oven. You know, I look and see if they have any foil wrap. Because I'm seeing in the grocery store they have, but the ones that they have look like it paper tin. And I just don't like the prices. I think these are plastic bags, like storage bags. Yeah. And check to see if I find a, a knife or two. Hard for me to eat my food with just the fork. See, I would like to have containers, but these are so small. These are just so, so 
quite a small one, which if I had like a big one, because I'm working high science to store any left. Oh, look, this knife. This is it. I wonder if it's this day. See, because this is good and watch today. I think this, this is, I don't know if it's sharp or not. I think so. I don't like them with this red, you know, this edge. Like if it was a smooth edge. Like if it was an edge like this, you see this one here, but if it was this one with a bigger knife. I don't know how this one is at the lens. And then you see the, the thing look like it will get out of shape. Are you the pass? Oh, it's your back shoe. Yeah. Oh, gosh. I was feeling excited for a moment, thinking. Oh. Yeah, you see nothing for like pirates. I don't, and I don't know if these is like oven safe, because you can't tell. And I won't try neither. The oven could clean it, but if my food were gone, the one I don't want. Going to the cleaning stuff. So you could come here and get your little apartment together without spending millions. Just like Dollar Tree. I should check to see if they got any dishwashing liquid because the one that I had, I think it might be on the other side. Let me see. It might be over here. Yes, it will be more at the back. Let me get up to here. Excuse me. Sorry. No, it's okay. Thank you. I have to look for something to drink. Okay, let me get in the corner here. Rice cakes. No sugar added. Nope. Anything that have no sugar added is a horrible taste and stuff. forever sardine. I have one there. I need to get it. Use it up. Uh, buy my pink salt from them already. Okay, let me see. Could I move to here? That is a Dollar Tree. Okay. Yeah. That is a Dollar Tree. Oh, look at an ice cream shop. Uh, ice cream shop. Look with this knife. No, you might have to push punch with the one that I have. All right. I think, guys, I need to stop talking because I'm sorry, feeling hungry. So I'll we'll have to stop and find something to eat. With passion. Two bob shop. I don't know. You know what? I, guys, I did like a circle. 
You see where I came from is when I turned one side of the street. I'm now walking down here. I will get back to where I am on the other side of this street. That, on the other side of it. This is, I didn't know this. Anyway, every day you learn something new. Yes. I just can't believe it. Walking back that way would take me, let me see how if I could describe it. All right. Like a drawing a blank now, how to describe it. But anyway, it's in the corner and I walk to my left and I come wrong this major road and then I ended up on the right side. I'm gonna walk by the way. Because it's more colorful and the other way I'm more familiar with is where I've been walking all the time. So I think I'm gonna walk by the way. Anyway, I think it's time for me to stop. Going back the other way. I just stopped and had something to eat. And I'm taking the walk on the same road but on the other side going in the opposite direction that I took you guys earlier getting to see better what I will see as I walk that's the street gut lane I'm reaching back far more quickly than when I was going in the other direction. It looked like it took forever. I'm right back at the junction and look over the road. There's the store that I told you guys that is like dress for less. This is it. Right back to the corner, turn ring center. This is a big, like a shopping mall. You go in there, they have banks and and other stores. You see in the big thing there. Oh, no. I don't know what's the name of this store. See the wrong boat. I like that multicolor house in the background. You see it there? I think I should cross there. You no, know, they have a traffic light up that way. I'll leave it across. Okay. This is a pharmacy. See these little mandarin oranges. I don't know if you could pick it, but they're all wrong. See. Passing by by the place that I do not miss. Perhaps I should be on the other side of the road over there. I think I should. But getting over there is the next thing. Uh, let me see. I think I'll cross here, then cross over there.
den här var klar att se. Nice to walk. Come on the street. Okay, I think I'm gonna cross here and get back on the other side. I'm debating whether or not I should do that. Okay, I think I'll go up a bit more. I don't think I should have gone over here. Yeah. Because. Because it's, it's, it's colorful. I think I'll go back and. Should I buy from here or the people in my neighborhood that I've been buying from? Thinking. I think I'll go back to my neighborhood. Support the people there. The only thing I'm, I'm not seeing a butcher shop. This is the one that I'm not seeing. I have to see over there. Mostly like businesses. I'm going to the store of my home and see if I find a knife. I think Karen told me to check there. They might even have a container that I could store extra food in. It look like no tree. Oh, yes. I wish if it was bigger. When I see what I want, they are small. Okay, so I had a big one, but when I had it in a whole set. I don't need a whole set. I think I'll let this one do. Oh, look this one here. This is bigger, better. I wonder how much of this one is. They don't have the cover, but it's, it's a bigger knife. And this is the one that I really want. A larger knife, you see? Hopefully a little bit of cut like meat with it. Let me see if I could find a dish that I could put in the oven. Oh, let me see these containers. That one there's too huge. This one here. See the one at the top? It's too big. This other one here. I don't want to be spending too much because I don't see myself, especially carrying the containers with me. I will take the knives, but not the containers. So you know what? Let me just stick with the knife. This here together, these two together. This one here. I don't need a knife. Oh, guys, know this guy used to be on Food Network. I'll walk with it and see what's the cost. Then I'll decide whether or not to buy it. The mere fact that they have this face on it. I might kick it up a notch. Alright. What else do I need? Oh, look at this. I wonder if this could... Okay, see these? These look like it's Pyrex, but it is small. Because these... I could pack stuff in it and then put it in the suitcase. It wouldn't be like too big and I could move around with it. 
but this is a small one this is like a waste of I have small enough containers so that I wish if I had something bigger and perhaps I should look for file for the oven and you see where this side here it's like beauty stuff not interested the toilet bowl cleaners let me see here have I see like the whisk and things there bamboo kitchen tools okay I'm not seeing a foil wrap I'm not seeing a foil wrap this is clear household stuff sorry again you say oh like the Christmas party with Muhammad Ali and his daughters I wonder if there's any copyright problem there I doubt whether they would ever find all this happening. I think I need to get out because I'm not making much progress. Okay. You know what? All the time I'm looking for glass for plastic. What about one of these glass bowls? But then again, they're so small. I wish it could work. Yes. All right. Things to get back into the house and get done. So let me. Excuse me. Thank you. They don't have cover. Not seen anything like that. Let me see what's this size of these. Oh, these are bad. What's the price of this? One hundred and fifty lakh. One hundred and fifty, yes. and this is yes. same price. Yes. Okay. I think I'll take this one now. Yeah. Let's see if you guys recognize any snacks here that you know. Okay, this walk is one. This is just like a, a walk. It's like two dollars. It's four hundred and twenty. I bought myself some pistachio nuts and I ate it all out. So I'm bordering on no snacks again. In forever Russia. Hard sparrows all over. This is called Big Market. I don't know what the chicken here. You see if I not all over. This is nice, huh? So this is 169. The kind of that you saw early over the street here one was like nearly 1800 like this is 1700. This is the nuts that I bought that I don't have none not much remaining. Okay, this have to find the layout of this some farm it's more gonna look like tomato juice or sauce I guess there's a bag and you just take with the protein vegetable this is interesting so then you have an option of picking up how much of the green beans or red peppers that you would like you see the bag and the container there. that's nice that is frozen okay we're well, let me go to the food area because if I walk to the beauty area it's just for you guys to see to the different kind of cheese and butter yes I bought some it doesn't have any sugar inside of it you see this brand of cheese is at Publix in Atlanta you see the cream cheese and you see original Philadelphia so some of the brands that you see it here, I saw almond milk, which the yeah, almond milk is just 11% almond, so the rest will be water, not interested. I bought this yogurt, this one here. At this time in my life, now I have to be eating for 90% nutrition and 10% taste. Because me having a uh, yogurt without any sugar who knows a year ago would not have but not now yes this is all the tin meat you see the salmon oh, my sardine i wanted to have kippers here i bought myself some couscous and quinoa which i had was very good this is not to tell anybody to start drinking this time of the day 
fuck. I'm just showing you. Oh. They have different kind of water here. I guess you could just get the individual bottles. Let me see. The one that I purchased, it was 60. Like, let me see. They have it here. Individual. And let me see. They got three. I think all of these here is like 30. Oh. This is 850. You see a knife, but this is 850. The one I purchased is 150. This is 850, and the others is what? When you calculate it, it might be but like ten dollars or something like that. Okay, let me see. Who knows? You might stumble on a nice container here because they got a lot of stuff here. The biscuit, sugar, tea, and coffee. That's nice. Let me feel these pots. They're not light, you know, guys. Press fry pan. They're not. They're not like those. They feel flimsy. No. The one that I have in the apartment there, that thing do not stick. Regardless of what in it, it look. It will burn the stuff. But then when you go to clean it out, it's sliding off very easily. It's a good pan. You see. Let me feel this bacon. Yeah, these pans are not no flimsy pan. It's sturdy. I wonder how much of these containers here. I wonder how much. Well, oh, this one is two ninety nine. This one is one seventy. Look that. I think that one up there. The three different colors. This six fifty nine. This is three twenty. And this is three twenty. Might be just over two dollars. Oh, let me see. This is what well, you see these aluminum foil thing. These things roll up and they look this one might be supposed to be more better. You see you pay more for it. But that's tin as ever. That's Karen if she has any which one she buy. Okay. Let me take you guys. Oh this is like a party area. Get out of there balloons and things like that you have candles these look like it arm deodorant garnier arm deodorant i never knew garnier got arm deodorant i see a colgate ajax palm olive you see some of the yes it's okay yeah some of the brands that you're familiar with oh instead of mr clean is mr proper he observed not Mr. Clean, Mr. Proper. Perhaps, perhaps in the language, clean is, is spelled proper. Here am I. I might buy this one here. I have a glass, it's a dishwasher. Because you don't have any in the house, do you? And I understand when it's a short term, I don't know. Like for instance, me that is spending nearly a month if they're supposed to. Then, then the okay. Pantina head and shoulder. Dove at the bottom there. Let's see. Yep. Mouthwash. And I think in some cases, let me see like this here. Look this body wash. The Dove body wash, three hundred and fifty. Like this is far cheaper. This is just over two dollars. The last time I look at these things in Atlanta, you might be looking at at the size. You're looking at maybe about over ten US dollars. But you know, it's based on where it was made. Sometimes the smell might be different, you know, whatever. It's kind of different kind of Nutella is all over. Nutella is all over. Oh, we should look and see if they have any tea. See all the different kind of cereals. Some that we don't even see. Let me see. This is a very popular brand here. Oh, this stuff here, 24 pieces. Here's a nut cream. Yes, this is this area for children. Children food. You see this brand here? I would see it in 
all parts of Atlanta. Because this place where I did more see shopping for years. And I never buy it. Look at the free sun. Because it's always too expensive. And especially since I wasn't certain about the taste. That kind of juice. Okay. Heinz hot mustard. Let's see if you see any brown or olive oil that I'm familiar with. Pasta. Excuse. Thank you. Okay. Let me see the other side. Oh, here, color. And things like crazy. I'm guessing men stuff here. More Garnier stuff here. I guess this will be skin cream. Well, guys, I'm back in the house with my grocery shopping. And totaling the amount of money that I spent, I think I might have to get a job. Between this water, I think this was six. And this pasta, which I thought would have had sauce. I don't have sauce. So I bought spinach. I will be sauteing some spinach with that later on for dinner. This and this and a slice of pizza, which I will insert in this video. That was 560 like. This was 150. This was 100. This... These two eggplant, these tomatoes, I bought it. It looks so pretty. I never see it like this. These bananas, these oranges and tangerine and plums. These three pears. What else did I bought from that guy? Oh, my thing of spinach. Do not look at how my refrigerator is empty. That spinach there. Okay, and these six eggs. I could tell it came out to somebody backyard, which is good. And what else I bought from him? I don't think anything else. That was 1,280 lek. Oh, there was 1,280 lek. And then the eggs was 240 lek because one egg is 40 lek, right? So six, four is a 24, two, four to there. So... This is 560, this is 100, this is 150. These here is 1280. This is the bananas and the spinach, 1280. Plus this is 240. My fish in here, which I'm ready to take out, that was 1180. Then I passed by the bakery. I said, let me just get a whole wheat roll. Don't get with a whole bread because then I'm going buck crazy. I saw this little dessert it looks nice and this here i don't know what this is between the three of them i think the three of them came up to how much it was 180 180 legs so a total was three thousand six hundred and ninety legs so guys i'm in a bad shape because here is three thousand no i'm just joking when i just did the conversion was $33.90. But imagine I get $33.90 for with fish involved. Look at these bananas. These kind of cherry tomatoes. Uh, any tomatoes on the vine plus cherry tomato on the vine. You pay in an arm and a leg. You got this eggplant and the plums and the tangerine and the oranges and the pears. And look all this this knife I bought this washing and eggs for thirty three dollars and thirty nine cents. That is a steal. So don't worry, you would not have to get money to me if I stay in here. If I change, well then, I'll catch you guys later.